your mom. Well, I just spoke to your Uncle Harold, and apparently he just bought a house. Why are you telling me this? Because I told him that you would be the one to help him move in. You did. Invite Richardson. Where are we going? We're going to Salt Lake City, the crossroads of the West. I just need to pack a couple things, clean up my grandmother's lamp. Hi, I'm Ben. I'm so sorry. That's cool. I... She's got others. You know, since I'm between things, I, I thought it'd be most economical for me not to move out. I've been telling him he should open his own like, decorating service or a cleaning service. He's very neat. Did you actually bring your own sheets? Well, tell me he's only changed the sheets about 60% of the time. <laughs> I'm not going to sleep in someone else's soot. We had $400 in an account. Now there's zero in an account because you decide to let me spend Wait, all my money. Me, are you blaming this on me? You know, everything I do and say you call gay. Just tell me, what, what do you think, I'm gay? I'm not gay. Richardson, pull over the car. You know, if I were a therapist, I would use this you to help my clients. You would be the worst like therapist. It's right on Grow Harold, 110 Crab Apple Lane. This'll do. Well, it's not really a matter of if it'll do or not. Is, is this the house you bought? Then this is the house, just park. I had a really great time last night. But, okay. But I don't want my car to smell like weed. And this place probably has security okay. all over. It definitely doesn't. And believe me, I will not be the only self-medicated person here. All right, well, let me get a little hit while yeah, we're here. Yeah, I'm good.